My name is Jacob Harmon, and I'm so thankful for inspiration and fresh vision that comes from the Lord. A little over a year ago, after many loving hints from my wife, I decided to improve my eating habits. I set out to build a small garden on our patio and began to teach myself how to grow our own vegetables in hopes of a new and improved healthy lifestyle. Soon we began to enjoy salads from our very own garden, delicious tomatoes, leafy greens, peppers, even wheatgrass, all grown on our humble little patio. Life was good. On Good Friday of 2009, as I was sitting there next to my little garden, enjoying some time with the Lord, God gave me a vision to reach the lost through the practical means of food production. I recognized that the Lord was speaking to me, and I began to see various vignettes from some of the mission trips that I've had the privilege to be a part of. As the images scrolled across my mind, images from Mexico, Central America, India, I felt the Lord telling me, this can happen anywhere. I told Pastor Chuck about this vision, and we both got excited about the potential of taking this technology to the mission field. He prayed for me and encouraged me to refine this process and prepare it for application and missions. Over the past year and a half, I've been diligently pursuing better ways to get these hybrid farms out to the mission field for as low of a cost as possible. I've been writing a curriculum, teaching small classes, and making instructional videos in hopes that many will learn this process and join me in this vision to reach out to our impoverished brothers and sisters all over the earth for the glory of God. I'm challenged by what the scripture says in 1 John chapter 3, verse 17 and 18. If anyone has material possessions and sees a brother or sister in need, but has no pity on them, how can the love of God be in that person? Dear children, let us not love with words or speech, but with actions and in truth. I also think of Jesus in his loving restoration of Peter in John 21, verse 15. And Jesus said to Simon Peter, Simon, son of John, do you love me more than these? Yes, Lord, he said, you know that I love you. Jesus said, feed my lambs. My prayer is that through the simple yet vital act of feeding people, we will be able to demonstrate a powerful and irrefutable statement of God's love. Please pray that the Lord would be glorified in and through this endeavor, and that many will come to the saving knowledge of Him through this agricultural missions ministry. Thank you so much for your prayers, and God bless you.